What do we have for Leo Collective Spirit? We need clear, intuitive messages for Leo Collective and the love life. Okay, so we got the Hangman Reverse for your first card, Leo. too many. We got the four of swords reversed. Okay, so some of you guys let go of somebody, but y'all could be having a hard time mentally letting it go for good, Leo. We need one more card. Or it could be somebody else. If this is not you, Leo, this could be somebody else that's mentally having a hard time letting it go. So we got the Ace of Wands right here. Yeah, it's because somebody really desired this person to come back. Somebody is not ready to let it go. Whether this is you or whether this is them. Somebody that let go of somebody is having a hard time mentally letting it go. And once again, it's because somebody desired that person. Okay, we're gonna dig a little bit deeper and see what else is taking place. What else is taking to the next one for Leo? Okay, we got the Knight of Swords reverse. Okay, okay, somebody that walked away, Leo. This person walked away because they didn't want any arguments with you. They didn't want no tension. Um in regards of you. Some of y'all's person is just trying to like avoid confrontation. Maybe they're afraid of you, you know, confront them about something that that they did, which is like I said, they may have sacrificed you. Whoever this is, this is somebody that that walked away from you, Leo. So it's like instead of coming forward now, they could just be like purposely holding back because they don't want you to, you know, they don't want to explain themselves, basically. And they don't want any arguments with you, Leo. But mentally, somebody's having a hard time letting go of the other person. I feel like it's the person that left you, Leo. I strongly feel like it's not you. I feel like the person that let you, that left you, Leo, is having a hard time mentally letting it go. But they was the one that ended it, Leo. They really desire you, whoever this is. This person really does desire you. It's just that... They don't want to argue with you, Leo, and they don't want to have to explain themselves. So they'd rather not speak to you because we got the Queen of Swords right here. Yeah, they feel like you're going to cuss them out. They feel like you're going to cuss them out. So they just rather avoid you in general. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Pisces or air sign or it could be another um, fire sign. But I am getting that energy, Leo, where this person is literally, they stay thinking about you, whatever. And they came, they really not really, they really did not mean to walk away from you, Leo. And to be honest, they was not ready to leave you. It's just that some of y'all's person did walk away because they had other things they had to do. Maybe they had to focus more on a business or their career, Leo, or they had some work. But some of y'all, this could be somebody that live at a distance from you, Leo. But mentally, they having a hard time letting go of you. Because deep down inside, some of y'all this person desire you too much. And that's why they walked away from you. Whoever this is, Leo, they may like you way too much than they may, you know, present it themselves to be. You know what I'm saying? But I strongly feel like this person feel like you're going to give them a cuss out. Dang, y'all got to be dealing with an air sign. This is a lot of air energy. This person is definitely wanting to come back. They desire the crap out of you, Leo. This person is talking to other people about you behind your back i don't think it's anything bad but it could be but at the same time for the most part even if they is talking ish about you behind your back leo just know in reality that's not how they really feel in reality they really want you in reality that's what they just making it seem like you know you was the bad guy some of y'all but deep down inside they really want you but we're gonna dive a little bit deeper and see what else is getting ready to take place or has taken place because some of y'all's energy is already passed but I strongly feel like your person deep down inside, they want to come forward because they, in reality, desire. You know, it's crazy. And that could be another reason why they're talking ish about you is because they know that they're afraid. 
your person is afraid. Some of y'all's person are only saying stuff because they think that it's going to get back to you. You see what I'm saying? And that could be a way for them to, for you to reach out to them, especially if they know it's going to get back to you, Leo. That could be their way of, of get of, um, of, instead of them having to come forward, Leo, and do all the work and explain themselves, they'd rather not. So they'd rather talk to another person bad about you in order to get you to, um, to get a rise out of you. Because they know whatever they say about you is going to get you to come forward and confront them, Leo. You see what I'm saying? Wow. Whoever this is. <laughs> but that's the energy that I'm picking up on. So what else do we have, Spirit, for Leo? Ten of Pentacles reversed. Wow. Yeah, they left you. Some of y'all, they may have left you broke. Maybe they messed up your stability in a way. Some of y'all have plans on being with this person, having a family with this person and everything. And they turned around and walked away from you. Some of y'all do have kids with this person. Or maybe y'all just used to live together and y'all had, you know, y'all was living real good until they turned around and, you know, messed up your stability, Leo, and left you. This is somebody that's not really looking for a long-term commitment, Leo. This is somebody that just desires to sleep with you. I'm going to be real with you. They do desire to sleep with you, Leo, but I'm not seeing that they want a family with you or whatever. Ace of Wands reversed, and then we got Justice. But yeah, this is somebody that you're not even thinking about, Leo. This is somebody that you don't even desire. You may not want anything to do with this person anymore. Yeah, they may desire to come back and mess around with you, but I feel like y'all don't y'all don't desire to deal with this person anymore. Some of y'all are already in a commitment. Maybe you could be married right now to somebody else, Leo, while you got this ex wanting to come back and have sex with you. But listen, I am getting that energy where some of y'all could be already committed elsewhere. If not, I am getting this energy the more you don't think about this person. Because I feel like a lot of y'all have already let go of this person. Maybe in the past you used to have really like obsessive thoughts over this person and wanting this person and desiring this person like they desire you but i feel like y'all have cooled down like you don't have those thoughts anymore leo you don't some of y'all are definitely getting good karma right now that's what y'all doing y'all minding y'all business a lot of my leos are minding their own business right now could be married to somebody new if not you could just i just feel like a lot of good things is happening for you right now you know and Meanwhile, you got this air sign X that could be gossiping about you because they mad because because they know if they come back, they're going to have to explain themselves. You see what I'm saying? And they're afraid of getting cussed out because they really don't know how you feel. They don't know how you feel. They don't know if you're going to cuss them out if they come back. They don't know if you're going to. They don't know if you're in another relationship. They don't know none of that because some of y'all could be dealing with somebody else. Y'all sleeping good at night. I strongly feel that. But what else, Spirit? Some of y'all could be, this could be a Libra or a Pisces. The X could be. Or the new person. If you are talking to somebody new, some of y'all are definitely being treated really well by somebody new. And it could be a Libra or a Pisces or a fire sign. And then you got like an air sign X that's the, the one that is afraid of is being a coward and don't want to come forward. But they rather talk about you to other people at the same time. Some of those persons do know you in a relationship. And they could be talking ish about the simple fact that you are in a relationship with somebody else. Because I'm clearly getting that also. Some of y'all, if y'all are married to somebody else or if you are in a, um, another connection just dating somebody else your person is definitely gossiping behind your back because you are in another commitment with somebody else Leo and they don't like that they're mad because they can't get no they can't get none of that that's why they're mad they're mad because they can't sleep with you no more they don't have that access to you like they used to that's why they gossiping about you that's all it is this person is upset because they don't have that access to you even though they want that access to you but they're afraid of you get you cussing them out Leo you know, because they really wasn't ready to, to be over with you, Leo. Bad health. Somebody could be going through some bad health. Maybe somebody could be in a hospital right now. Or maybe they was in a hospital. But you leaving them, Leo, is making them sick. It, 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 like, you leaving this person, it makes them sick to their stomach, Leo. They don't like that. Clear intuitive messages, please. But I feel like y'all done because this person put you through a lot. Some of y'all, 
Listen, some of y'all's person put you through a lot to the point you really had to like, you, maybe you ended up in the hospital because of this person, right? Maybe you, your stress levels went up so bad to the point where you ended up in the hospital, right? And um, and maybe you had to pack your stuff and go. Some of y'all literally packed y'all stuff and went out of town away from this person, Leo. Some of y'all literally went out of town or you just completely moved house. You moved residence, Leo. After this person walked away from you, after this person ended, um, left you, Leo, I surely get that for some of y'all. Literally, you know, packed your stuff and you you completely moved far away from this person as much as possible because they put you through a lot. I surely feel that. I feel like this person put you through a lot, but I feel like for the most part, you don't desire to get back together with this person. Some of y'all are definitely fine right now. Like y'all could be married to somebody else for one, for two. Some of you guys once again, y'all could just be. Um, dating, maybe you're getting courted, Leo, and being you being treated fair. Life is doing good for you. Life is doing really well for you, Leo. And um, I strongly feel like a lot of y'all in y'all good karma energy right now. Some of y'all are definitely in y'all good karma energy. Didn't I say some of y'all have packed y'all stuff and created change? Like y'all literally moved house. Some of y'all moved out of town and everything. Some of y'all have even switched cars on this person. <laughs> <laughs> maybe you did everything some of y'all when this person left you Leo like I said some of y'all ended up sick in the hospital because of this person and maybe you had to move residence some of y'all had to move out of town or to another country some of y'all definitely um switch cars on this person like maybe you had to change your car your vehicle or something but I'm seeing a change in everything Leo like everything ever since this person left you everything has changed Leo completely but this person is sick over simple fact that you have moved house. Because some of y'all's person probably tried to come to your house and they found out you wasn't there. That could be the energy. Some of y'all's person found out you wasn't there or that somebody else told them, Leo, that you had moved out of town or you moved to another country, Leo, and um, switched up on you and changed your vehicle and everything. They skipped their blessing. That's what happened. Because like I said, a lot of my Leos that I'm talking about is in a, in a good karma phase right now. Like life is doing good for you. Like, literally, those are the Leos that I'm talking about. Life is doing really good for you, Leo. What else, Spirit? Clear intuitive messages, please. I feel like, for the most part, that could just be the end of that. But we're going to dive a little bit deeper. What else, Spirit? I just keep hearing some of y'all definitely did change residence on this person. And when they came back, he was not there. He was not there. But they wait, and somebody could be waiting to do something, Leo. Because you changed, because you left, somebody could be invested into you. Didn't I say that? Some of y'all could be dating somebody else new, or you could be married to somebody right now that is invested into you, Leo. But we're going to see. Some of y'all been been waiting for a very long time to create this change. And maybe you are finally getting this change, Leo, where you had to say, maybe some, maybe you had to save up your money in order to, to move, Leo. Some of y'all did have to save up y'all money. Maybe it took some time, Leo. But I am seeing things start to materialize for you, Leo, because you turned your back on someone. And y'all going towards new. Y'all definitely going towards new if you have not, Leo. If you have not met anybody new, some of y'all will meet another soulmate, Leo, that will like literally make you happy after walking away from somebody that was very, I'm here temperamental. Some of y'all were dealing with somebody that had anger problems, Leo. And maybe you struggled a lot financially and your stability wise when you was dealing with this person because the Ten of Pentacles is reversed right here. Yeah, but like I said, you no longer desire this person anymore. I feel like a lot of y'all, y'all been got over that person. Y'all been let go of that energy. I feel like you're not spiritually connected to this person anymore because like I said you have like literally disconnected your energy from this person Leo to the point where you no longer desire them because I'm seeing it twice we got that stands out the most and it's spread we got the um the ace of wands reversed and then we got passion ignited it's saying that y'all have completely disconnected from this person mentally and spiritually so strongly to the point where you don't even think about this person and you don't desire them anymore like you used to that's the energy that I'm picking up on. But they desiring you because they mad. They just, they just want access to you. They mad because you you doing good right now. That's all. And they don't know where you at. Some of y'all's person don't know where you at. They just don't know where you at. They can't have access to you. And that's why they ain't their feelings over there. But we got the Ace of Cups right here reversed. So some of you guys may not even want love right now. Maybe you're not looking for a relationship right now, Leo. But I am seeing a lot more investing love into yourself more than anything. Y'all are definitely investing into yourself right now in regards of love and just in general. But I am seeing that most of y'all love is not the um 
is not is not a focus to you right now. Even if y'all are getting love offers, I feel like you're rejecting them, Leo. Because I feel like a lot of y'all focus just on y'all stability and growing y'all wealth. And, um, you know, I feel like you just want a better life. And that's exactly what y'all get in Leo. It may take some time, Leo. I'm also hearing it has took some time. But just know it's getting ready to materialize, Leo. It really is. Y'all have working really been working really, really hard on something, Leo. And because you put love on the back burner, Leo, and been placing your focus more onto y'all work, I'm telling you, spirit got something good for you, Leo. Spirit got something good for you. And it, it requires you to let go of something that you may have been holding on to. And I feel like it has everything to do with this person. I hate sideways cards. And it's coming in really fast, Leo. We got the Knight of Wands. So whatever hard work that you, whatever you've been working on, Leo, it's getting ready to happen for you. It's, it's coming out of nowhere. That's exactly what I'm hearing. Something is getting, I'm getting a whoosh. Of energy right here, like literally, somebody something is getting because y'all, y'all yeah, have definitely let go of this person, but they hold a resentment towards you, Leo, because they can't hurt you no more. They mad because they don't have access to you no more. They mad because they don't know where you're at. They, basically, you switched it on. You switched up on. You flipped the script on this person, Leo. You know, and I, I strongly feel like the energy is gone. Like they can't feel your energy anymore. They know you're not thinking about them anymore. You in your good karma phase right now. But they hold in resentment, Leo, because like I said, they can't use you no more. They can't have access to you no more. No matter what it is, Leo, they mad because you live in a stress-free life. A lot of my Leos are in this phase that they are living a stress-free life. Some of you guys, maybe you're getting ready to be in this phase where you are going to live a stress-free life where you, without all the drama with this that comes with this person, Leo. You see what I'm saying? But I'm going to go ahead and end it right here. I hope it resonates and y'all take care.